The necktie, or simply the tie, dates back to the Thirty Years' War in the 1600s. Croatian mercenaries wore them during battle, and the French took notice. Soon, Louis the Great was wearing them. Today, it's the centerpiece in men's fashion. When you see a man who has a nice tie, it's tied right, it's that classic look, what does that say about him? It tells me that this person really knows what they're up to. It's a little bit like a private club. Alex Wilcox owns Lord Willie's. He's British, he's fancy, and his suit and tie are his battle armor. He's ready to take on the day. He says, for a gentleman who wants to look sharp and professional, there are three signature ties every man should own. So the first tie that any man should have is a navy tie, and quite a deep navy. The beauty of a, of a especially a deep navy tie, is that it's going to allow all the other colors to breathe. So something like this is going to work just as well with, for example, a gray suit, or even maybe a plaid. So the tie itself is the grounding element, and the other fabrics breathe around it. Choose your colors wisely. You know, if, you, if you're a little pinky in skin color, then the dark reds are going to bring that out, or, you know, but again, if you have a little bit of olive in your skin, great colors like chocolate or dark green or purples are going to look beautiful. What is your take on the skinny tie? So, um, skinny ties for me are a little bit of a, of a faux pas. 18 year old wearing a skinny tie as part of a band looks great, but when it's a, a guy in his 30s who's working for a banking corporation, the skinny tie is sort of saying, you know what, I could wear this to go to a pub or to a nightclub, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm with it. Mm -hmm. But I'm not sure that's the image that you want to be conveying in a, in a mm. business world. Rather than um, expressing yourself in colour, you can express yourself in graphics. So what this little look that I've put together here is, uh, it's a pinstripe suit with a check shirt with a polka dot tie which when you put those three together as a sentence shouldn't work. No. I mean, it should, it should be very messy. What is your thought about little airplanes or little monkeys or little bananas? Not crazy about that kind of thing. I've often felt, you know, the sort of uh, the little pigs and the little ducks. It's kind of cute, but it just looks like someone bought, bought you them for Christmas, really. There's a, they look like gifts. When they put it on for the first time, does that boost their confidence? Yes, absolutely. We pop them in a good tie and throw a jacket on, and it's incredible to see that the inner peacock has, has just kind of emerged. 